This is Mary Kelly with Top Secret Leadership. One of my first books is called Master Your World, 10 Dog-Inspired Leadership Lessons to Improve Productivity, Profits, and Communication. Now, I wrote this book to help bridge the gap between how we treat our justifiably very spoiled and loved dogs and the people we work with. What people at work say that they're missing is feeling valued at work. You know who doesn't have to worry about feeling valued at work? My dogs. My dogs are amazing at helping me feel valued too. Now, the dogs may not be CEOs, but they can still teach us a lot about leadership. So here are some of the points from this book that I thought we might be able to take again from the dogs. Number one, be loyal. Dogs are known for their loyalty and commitment to their pack or their family. As a leader, it's important to be loyal to your team and to demonstrate a commitment to their success. Loyalty up comes from loyalty down. If you want people to be loyal to you, you need to be loyal to them. Number two, be happily confident. Most dogs are actually confident, and this confidence can be contagious. As a leader, it's important to exude confidence and inspire others to have confidence in their abilities. Number three, be a good listener. Dogs are excellent listeners, and they're attuned to the cues and body language of their humans and other dogs. As a leader, it's important to listen actively and pay attention to the needs and concerns of your team. Number four, be patient. Dogs are patient animals, and they're willing to take the time to train and teach their humans. As a leader, it's important to be patient with your team and to provide the support and guidance they need as they learn and grow. And number five, be resilient. Dogs are resilient and they're able to bounce back from setbacks and challenges. As a leader, it's important to have resilience and the ability to persevere through difficult times. By incorporating these leadership lessons from a dog's perspective into your leadership style, you can become more effective and successful at work. This is Mary Kelly. See you next time.